Okay, so I thought I'd show you a bit more detail in how I'm constructing my uh, Motorola baseboards. They're each going to be two foot square, and I've got about 10 of them in total. And the way I've done it is using this 9mm ply. All right. Uh, it's 70 millimeters tall to allow any room for points or any other wiring or gadgets I put underneath my baseboards to the lighting or whatever. And the way I've done it, I've basically got this wood, which I think was about a meter long each piece of board, and I chopped that down to 70 millimeter pieces to match with the height of the plywood I've got there. Uh, as you can see, I've got the block here, that's basically so that these screws I'm putting in the sides have got something to bite into. And I've got it as flush as I can on the sides there. So that when I attach all the baseboards together, it should be as straight as possible. And the way I've done this is basically, let me just flip this around to show you. So I glued these onto the, these to start with, so it's held in place. Then what I'm gonna be doing is putting some glue on there and on this side. I then use this jig to help me get everything nice and flush. So I'll basically uh, will be sitting that underneath there in the corner. Let me just do that like that. That then helps me with the other part of the baseboard, let me just pull that in. So roughly something like that. Then with the glue in place, I'll be cl clamping it pin in the corner there with my fingers, just to get it going, just long enough for the glue to hold it in place while I put a um, drill hole in with that drill. So these are two of the modules bolted together already. I've got another eight modules to use as well. If you can see, I've got bolts coming through here. There's a T-nut on this side. And if you look to the other side, you can see the bolt there. Which I'm going to 